So we just completed the ORAT 50,000 subscriber event, and I owe you a goals update. Yes, folks, we are trying to do the goals update once a week, let you know what's going on in my health, in the business, all of those things. I will let you know that I'm recording this Sunday morning, but or no, what is it? It's Monday. Gosh, that weekend went fast. Monday morning, but I did select all the stats Sunday night, so the spreadsheet is updated with the correct information. We will continue the streak of weekly reporting. I just didn't have the voice uh, to record a video yesterday. I hope you understand. So let's get into it. Let's see what last week had to what we had to do. So again, um, no, you know what? Let's go bottom up this time. So again, I don't know if you know this. We're seven weeks into 2024. Yes, folks, seven weeks down already in 2024. So we're going to start at the bottom. Why? I have no idea. I just feel like it. So uh, in the other category, we sold, <laughs> excuse me, zero or at swag. We're talking T-shirts, hats, stickers, things of that nature. Uh, I've actually come to the conclusion that I am going to remove, yes, remove most of my swag. And what I'm going to do going forward is we will have a couple of hats. I am trying to get the black hats resupplied. <laughs> and I will only have one t-shirt. I'm going to have one t-shirt available uh, for a month. So it's kind of limited edition. And then they will be gone, right? So the one that uh, will start on, Mon uh, on March 1st is the one that I've chosen. It is this one I'm wearing, cash flow over everything. So again, folks, if you like this t-shirt, uh, the only time you're going to be able to get it is in March. I guess technically you could get it today in fairness. But in March, it will be available for 31 days and then it will be gone. We may bring it back, but it will be, won't be brought back till 2025. So I'm going to try to create a little bit more of a limited edition. I'm not going to kind of get all crazy with it. So a couple hats, uh, coffee cups, obviously. I just love what the team did with the coffee cups and... Um, yeah, it was nice to see all the t-shirts as well at the event. A lot of you rocking the 50,000. Um, a lot of you enjoying different colors of that. So um, just know that that was noticed. I saw you and I thank you. Uh, book selfies. I just put down 50 plus. Obviously, we had our two-day event. Uh, I loved all the pictures, uh, all of that. By the way, if you did take my picture and you haven't tagged me yet on Instagram, please do. Uh, if you're in our private Facebook group, yeah, you're one of my students. Put it in the group. I think the the folks that couldn't make it would like to see the event. Uh, feel free to share your thoughts in our private Facebook group if you'd like. Again, not everybody could make it. Um, so yeah, let's uh, let's let everybody know what you thought, and um, yeah, we'll go from there. And then Amazon referral links. Yes, uh, we're up. We did eight bucks last week. Eight dollars Amazon referrals. What are these? These are, I guess, backlinks or referral links. I really don't understand what they are. But basically, they're links off of my books, uh, one rental at a time. Like if you click on them, I guess there's some cookie or something. I don't know. But basically, if you click on my link for 24 hours, I guess I get credit for your Amazon shopping. I think that's what it is. As for the course highlights, uh, thankfully, we didn't do zero. <laughs> that was a that was a rough week. I wasn't wasn't sure if I pissed you off or something. Uh, but we did uh, we didn't sell any of the main courses. How to get started one rental at a time at $399, zero. That is two weeks in a row we've done zero. We did sell a couple of $50 courses and a couple of $100 courses. Uh, you are liking the 10-week bootcamp replay. Again, if you're stuck, uh, I created that 10-week bootcamp one time. I will never do it again because uh, I wanted others to see. So we took 40-some-odd students through it. We talk about buy boxes and their their environments, their questions. Uh, I think that, uh, and by the way, if, I don't know if you remember this, but that was a thousand dollar commitment that these forty plus folks made, and uh, you get the benefit of watching it on replay for ninety percent off, so ninety nine bucks. So lots of people buying that. Lots of people should be buying that. Um, so there you go. Uh, and again, zero uh, or at uh, sales. And then finally, Facebook group. We did get six people to sign up. I guess it really helps when I mentioned that, hey, you bought the course, join the group. So thank you for all of that. Uh, going to book sales, 
Uh, again, 41 books sold of the main book, one rental at a time. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Looks like Amazon is catching up. We had five more reviews published. Uh, so now we're at 1,382. Uh, we sold three books of 15 conversations with real estate millionaires, which is, uh, I don't know what else to say, disappointing. And it's really disappointing because I tried to write something for the audience and maybe I missed. I tried to write, I tried to, I, I was trying to highlight that there's more ways to do it than my way. And um, yeah, 15 different stories. I really thought that would be better, but maybe, maybe poor execution, maybe the wrong stories. Um, I don't know, but um, yeah, I got to figure that out. Uh, and again, uh, no book reviews. So we're stuck at 56 all year, which I think is very interesting because I've heard from half a dozen of you, maybe five or six, that you have written a review. And while they seem to be updating on the main book, they're still stuck at 56. So I don't know. I don't know. Let me know if you wrote a review for 15 Conversations with Real Estate Millionaires. If I get enough of those notes, I guess I'll ping Amazon and say, what the heck, guys? What are you doing? What are you doing? So there we go. Uh, going forward, uh, the YouTube channels. So the main channel did uh, did explode. Uh, the team has cut up a couple of shorts of the Graham Stephan interview. Uh, a couple of those have done well for the channel. So we have a lot of views this week, 98,000. I will estimate that about 30,000 of those are shorts. Hey, but a views of you. So uh, thank you for watching. Uh, we did get 221 subs this week, so we exceeded our goal. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Like, subscribe, comment. I always forget to ask. So yes, uh, or at subs up to over 200 this week. Daily financial news, uh, trending just below the target. Uh, we're looking for 5,000. Uh, we did get uh, 47, call it 4,700. Uh, financial news, subs, uh, we did 30 last week. Again, a little bit below target. Again, the Daily Financial News channel is just that. It's trying to take the the daily, add some color and cut-ins and things of that nature. So appreciate the support. Uh, the Best of All Rat channel uh, doubled last week, uh, but did not hit goal. Uh, we did have one video uh, that started to do okay for the channel, and I appreciate you. And uh, Best of All Rat subs, uh, only five this week. So, uh, yeah, that is, yeah, is what it is. Conferences. I'm actually going to say we did one conference because we just completed the best or the best of uh, the ORAT 50,000 sub event. It was amazing. Um, we'll certainly do more videos on that. But the audience, the venue, the speakers, the weather, I mean, everything, everything was uh, better than expected. And um, yeah. I'm I'm still I I still have that buzz. So thank you, thank you for being a part of that. I uh, did record a couple of podcasts last week that should be coming out over the next couple of weeks on other platforms, other channels. Uh, again, look forward to doing more and more of those. All right, now for the personal goal, right? Trying to run a marathon, trying to lose some weight, trying to make some steps. Um, unfortunately, I lost um, Saturday, obviously for the event. Also lost. Oh most of friday to get ready for the event and sunday for the event these this is the reason this is a challenge for the steps is those are my long days i usually go for a long run saturday morning because we don't do a show and uh, obviously didn't do that so uh, the miles are down the steps are down and my weight's back to 206 <laughs> we did get to 204 uh, a couple of weeks ago but that is now gone so we've got some more work to do so at the end of the day uh, again, I recorded these stats yesterday, uh, but I did not get to record the video because my throat is uh, pretty raw. It actually still is a little raw. It feels like I'm feels like I got. Uh, it feels like I'm talking deeper. I got a little Brian Adam Adamson is a little deep bass in my throat. So, anyways, shout out, uh, shout out Brian, shout out all the millionaires, shout out everyone who came to the event. It it's uh, it's something we at least I won't forget. Uh, hopefully for the rest of my life. Uh, we did we did put out a 60 second or 55 second clip uh, that the team put up last night. Shout out to them for doing that so quickly. If you just want to get a taste of the event, uh, watch that uh, video, it's 55 seconds. Thank you very much. Take care. Bye.